Recently, I had made a video on a state-of-the-art mixture of experts model trained on over 1 trillion tokens. And yes, it's open source. It's called Kimi K2, and it's developed by a new Chinese AI startup called Moonshot AI. Kimi K2 is truly impressive as it's currently the most powerful open source agentic model ever released. But what sets it apart isn't just its scale, it's built not just to answer but to act. Kimi K2 is deeply optimized for agentic reasoning and execution, meaning it can handle multi-step tasks, tool use, function calling, and complex reasoning workflows. And here's the wild part. It actually rivals up against or even outperforms closed source giants like Claude 4 Sonnet, Opus 4, DeepSeek, as well as the Gemini 2.5. Now, there's two versions to this model that were released, the Kimi K2 base, which is a robust foundational model for researchers as well as builders who want to fine tune or customize their own version. Then you have the Kimi K2 Instruct, which is a chat ready, post-trained model, and it's designed for general purpose use cases as well as agentic applications. It's something that delivers fast reflex grade responses, and it's perfect for, for tool use as well as for animation and intelligent, perfect for tool use, automation, and intelligent agents. And another reason why many people are using this model currently is obviously because of its performance, but also because of its pricing. It's listed at 15 cents per 1 million input tokens with cash hit and 60 cents for 1 million input tokens with cash miss. Now it's also listed at $2.50 for 1 million output tokens, which is why it's definitely a great option to use as an alternative to something like Opus because it already beats Sonnet in many categories. And this is something that's open source where you can locally host it if you have the compute to run such a large model. Just take a look at it live in action. This is where Kimi K2 just created this gravitational wave visualizer. And essentially it was able to create this with a single prompt with no previous files, no guidance, just pure agentic coding. And this is actually something that would take multiple prompts to have generated with something like GPT 4.1 or even one of the DeepSeek models. This is why there's a lot of hype around this model due to its coding performance with front-end as well as back-end generation. With the combination of agentic tool use as well as front-end development, it's capable of generating pretty nice looking UIs with functional back-ends. This is my favorite example, and this is essentially where it was able to create this 3D Minecraft world. And you can see there's functional commands and different sorts of blocks that were all generated with the help of the Kimi K2 coder. And guys, for an open source model to be putting up these results is just insane. Even DeepSeek isn't capable of doing this. And this is something without reasoning that is coming up against something like Anthropic, Sonnet, as well as Opus 4 models, not just on Sway Bench but on agentic coding as well as competitive coding benchmarks, plus with tool use as well as math and STEM. This is why today I'm gonna to be showcasing how powerful this workflow could be by combining the Kimi K2, which is a powerful state-of-the-art open source model with another open source AI coder like Klein, which is gonna enhance your developer workflow. This is an autonomous AI coder that's capable of creating almost anything where it has the ability to edit files on its own, run commands, use MCPs, and much more. So having it powered by such a powerful open source model, you're gonna be able to get the best generations out of it. So to get started, you're obviously gonna need an IDE. So go ahead and install whatever IDE you want. Uh, you can use VS Code, WinSurf, Cursor, whatever it may be. Simply go ahead and have that ready, and then you can install the client extension within that IDE by going over to this website. So simply click on install for whatever ID you want to install it towards. But before we get started, allow me to introduce today's video sponsor, Kittle. Kittle is a powerful browser-based design platform that helps creators make stunning print-ready designs fast. Whether you're designing for apparel, POD, or digital products, it's packed with everything you need from 1200 plus fonts to photo mockups and textures, all under one subscription. And now it just got a huge upgrade. Kittle's all new vector editing suite brings pro level design tools into an intuitive interface. So you can finally edit curves, hats, and layers like a pro without Adobe headaches. Even better, with Kittle Teams, you can collaborate with your team or client in real time, give feedback, tweak designs together, and stay in sync from anywhere. 
Hit the link below to try out the new features. And if you're a new user, use the code in the description below at checkout to get 25% off your first month or year. That's Kittle. Create, collaborate, and design smarter. Once you have VS Code and Klein installed, simply go ahead and open it up. And within your editor on the left hand panel, you will see the client extension. Open it up and click on the settings tab. Head over to the API provider. You can either use Open Router. This is where they have listed the Kimi K2 model. You can simply go ahead and get the API key from here. It's pretty cheap, guys, in comparison to obviously the models that we obviously use on a daily basis, like Sonnet or even GPT. So you can create an API key from here. But say if you do not have the resources to do that, you can use something like Kilo Code. And this is essentially where they provide $20 worth of free credits and they have their own extension. So you don't even need to pay for anything. You can simply get this free credit so that you can start using the new Kimi K2 model completely for free. Now to showcase why this is such an impressive tool to use for coding, let's take a look at these results. This is where in my test video, I had showcased a couple of these generations like an SVG representation of a butterfly, which is probably one of the hardest prompts for most models to actually complete. Now, this is something that I was just testing out on my own, and it was able to create these functional, beautiful looking front end dashboards. This is a CRM dashboard that has the ability to track leads. Obviously, it's nothing super uh, difficult to create, but it had gotten the base structure correct. It added visual inputs to showcase all of these different data points. You're, you have the ability to add different clients, leads, and you have a notification uh, tab as well as a dark mode. All of this was fully coded out all on its own within their chatbot. Now imagine if you were to do that within something like Klein, you'd be able to get the best output even better than what you would see within this chatbot. So let's get started. I'm in Kilo Code right now and I'm using the free API and this is where I'm sending in a prompt to create an a SaaS landing page that has many features. Right away, it has gotten the API request and it's gonna work on autonomously executing this task. It's gonna be able to create files and make sure that it's able to create everything that's necessary for the front end to be functional. So let's see what it actually ends up developing for us. Now guys, unfortunately, there is one negative thing about this model and it's its speed. It outputs really slowly and you can see how slow it is in terms of generating these files. It has approximately taken, I believe, two minutes to generate all the files so far. Whereas if I had used something like Sonnet, it would have been way faster and it probably would have been completed by now. And there we go. This is our Cloudflow AI SaaS website that it had developed. Now, currently the dashboard preview is not loading, but aside from that, you have this uh, trusted by leading companies banner role. You also have the powerful features, animations. You have the SaaS, uh, typical SaaS uh, pricing plan structure, as well as the testimonial and FAQ. It had nailed all the components perfectly. If you like this video and would love to support the channel, you can consider donating to my channel through the super thanks option below. Or you can consider joining our private Discord where you can access multiple subscriptions to different AI tools for free on a monthly basis, plus daily AI news and exclusive content, plus a lot more. But that's basically it guys for today's video on this new Kimi K2 model being paired with Klein. This combination is truly remarkable and you should be able to get the best generations out of it with a cheap pricing that Kimi K2 provides. It's truly a remarkable mixture of experts model. Personally, for me, what I love the most about it is its tool use as well. Obviously it's competitive coding results, but its tool use is what I really like the most. And this is something that I'm gonna be using and having within my daily workflow. So I highly recommend that you take a look at this if you haven't already. This is an amazing open source agentic coding model that is really good in all fronts. And having it paired with Klein is definitely going to get you the best results. But with that thought, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for also subscribing to the second channel and supporting me on all of these different social fronts like the Discord as well as the newsletter. Follow me on Twitter. Make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel if you haven't already. Make sure you turn on the notification bell, like this video, and please take a look at our previous videos because there's a lot of content that you will truly benefit from. But with that thought, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Have an amazing day. Spread positivity, and I'll see you guys fairly shortly. Peace out, fellas.